Hello people, welcome back to month two for the month of July. I hope you all are doing fine. Uh, this is a new series um, where I show the month tour of my normal survival world and I show you what's around. Yeah. Uh, as you can see, uh, let's start right here. My spawn point was somewhere uh, back there, like 20 or so blocks over there. Uh, this was a ke creeper farm. Uh, it was actually rigged at first. I don't know what was happening, but then um, I did a couple of minor changes and all. Uh, now it's working, but I don't usually use it. Uh, that's the the EFK spot for this farm. I have also made this uh, iron farm which is very recent now usually I am not needing much iron because uh, you can see from my uh, non sorted storage system right here that uh, yeah uh, from here block of raw iron uh, block of raw copper uh, I also have I'm sure I have some yeah this is for yeah uh, some of uh, some of it I have still touched on the deep slate versions of that so that you know just as an ornament or something yeah uh, this is the copper some more I don't usually use copper but um, I thought it is a, it's a really cool block and uh, since I have some cute little bees over here and um, I have a lot of honeycomb and honey bottles uh, as you can see from here that I should use some copper more uh, but that will be for a different uh, time uh, I was trying to make this netherrack into netherrack into this thing the nylium this don't know what's it called exactly but uh, yeah but it works only in java Sadly, not in bedrock, bedrock and pocket edition. Sad stuff. Anyways, uh, moving on. Mm, here I have trapped a zombie villager, which is, I guess, an armorer. Yeah, he is an armorer, as you can see. Yeah, he was a good lad. At first, he gave me a little bit of shoes. And you will be surprised to know how much diamonds I have mined in this survival world. Actually, it's two. Oh my god! Wow! Yeah, only two. Uh, two uh, those two are used in an enchanting table I have set up in this mob farm. Uh, it's a small scale XP farm with uh, a skeleton dungeon. Uh, the design is of my own, some minor changes in some other designs. And it's um, not bad, I can say. Yeah. Uh, uh, the real skeleton XP farm, uh, the XP spawner is over uh, a little bit up, like 20 or so blocks, but uh, they fall down here and I can just one shot them with my silk touch pickaxe or such. Uh, but for that I need to AFK here first for some time and you might see them falling down from here. Uh, yeah, as you saw, uh, that was a skeleton falling down. There might be more of them. Yep, some wearing armor, cool armor. Yeah, let's just go down. I he heard a zombie, but I don't know where is it. It is. Yeah. Uh, everything I have has mending, even my diamond hoe, which I use it uh, many a times for. In uh, for carrots and fortuning them uh, you can see here my diamond sword has fire aspect 1 sharpness 5 uh, mending uh, with my pickaxe which has silk touch unbreaking 3 efficiency 5 in mending the other one has fortune 3 unbreaking 3 uh, efficiency 5 in mending the axe has unbreaking 1 efficiency 5 mending the bow um, it's not as good but it two shots creepers zombies and uh, skeletons and stuff so yeah it's good uh, so yeah it's unbreaking one and power two oh best part 
and breaking three efficient C3, mending and fortune too. The do boots not as good like feather falling and soul speed and all, but still I have brought four mending and breaking three or two two yeah a chest plate only has but prod four and mending uh, but i don't need really on breaking because i get a lot of experience and from villager trading and stuff and i can use that to well repair and as you can see it's full durability i don't have a legging uh, i don't have leggings right now i uh, i haven't got it from an armorer can you get i mean uh, i have about four or such armorers none of them have given me leggings all are chest plates boots and helmets and those are and as good as well and um, the aqua affinity prot 4 mending uh, prot 4 i have a villager so that's easy to get here's the grindstone which is the most important part i have grindstone all of the stuff like uh, the axe sword pickaxes the all of the armor and the, uh, then i have enchanted it and with the help of my trusty villagers over there in the village i'll show you it's very close to my spawn uh, i have been able to get this cool armor uh, and food is not a problem as you can see a lot of bread a lot of apples which i don't know why i have taken and finally unlock the trade of a farmer for giving me golden carrots which are really the best source of food i can guess i mean golden apples and uh, notch apples are there but well, you can't get them from villager trading and stuff, and they are not as easy to get. Golden apples have to be crafted or to be found in a dungeon chest. So I guess golden cats are the best staple diet for normal Minecraft player. Uh, here's the anvil, which anvil stuff, the grindstone, enchantment table, the bookshelves, uh, super speed staircase, and I guess it's night time, so I have to sleep yep uh, quickly quickly oh god damn it they can't deal with the fire aspected right now because so much skeletons oh oh not a creeper ah <sighs> Add stuff. Uh, yeah, it's hitting itself. Okay, it's dead. Now I can finally sleep. Thank God, the rain can also stop. Huh. Disturbing part in a Minecraft episode. Anyways, yeah, I'll probably chop down this husks. they really disturb me a lot here are the little furnaces occasional uh, yeah creeper is here to greet me hello mr creeper yeah as i told you it two shots creeper and stuff um oh hello there well Uh, yeah, moving on. So, here's the fuel source which fuels most of the things in my um, world. Yes, the lava, infinite lava source. Um, if I have some blocks to pull it up with, what am I? Oh, hello. Oh, ha, yeah. Uh, I forgot to tell you about this. This is the mine which goes down there uh let me get down yeah uh, as you can see here this is a trick that i learned from wadzi uh great guy i watch his videos uh here's uh, so what happens here is the this is why level 12 where i mine for diamonds uh then again i have a little mine adjacent to it down at y level 8 and adjacent to it down is at my uh, y level 5 which is really efficient to get diamonds but sadly this is the first version of uh, 1.17 which was which as you know was very rigged and you didn't get any diamonds or so uh, they were really hard to find so 
uh, yeah, yeah I have I got only I have gotten only two diamonds I guess this also works as a trash can to throw uh, this is a sweet berry farm which has given me a lot of sweet berries which I don't know what I use for but uh, yeah, there might be some occasional sweet berries in here yeah uh, here then here a lot of them not much here uh, moving on to the village okay this is my village there is the village door which I never used to get in I just come here from this birch dead tree to this is a really nice part of the terrain that uh, it's look it looks like a birch tree has fallen down from here which was like dead and so it's really cool and uh, I just jump from here when I need to get out I go from here yeah the doors are useless useless um anyways uh, then you go on to here there's the pig which usually roams around uh yes a uh, villager uh, yes I had gone mining for a few days and many of my villagers had sadly been dead uh, but I have most of my villagers but uh, yesterday I mean yesterday I mean yeah yesterday I was playing uh, here is the most important villager no yes fire aspect what the heck where's my mending villager don't tell me he died no 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 please here's the armorer who is useless he doesn't give me any leggings here's the good lad uh, which i played with for emeralds occasionally and the main dude who keeps me running with the energy yes he gives me golden carrots i'll take it thank you thank you thank you um, yeah another armorer sadly I had an efficiency 5 villager a mending villager and a sharpness 5 villager all of them are dead now <laughs> that's really sad uh, and I have litten all of this place up I don't want to use rooted dirt yeah, and a site yeah that'd be cool that'd be really natural mm. I have lightened up all I guess of this place but I don't know why they died uh, do villagers despawn please tell me in the comments do they despawn I want to know because they were really yeah they were really good villagers RIP villagers anyway mm, yeah this is the villager uh, that's normal village and this is a village design of my own uh these are the houses i am uh, playing a pattern like uh, first there are the dark oak it's the darkest pattern then the spruce uh, going ahead i'm sorry if you couldn't hear me yeah the dark oak here the spruce then i am trying to get a little bit of a town hall thing like a large one over by this river which i was trying to make which turned into a village transport system uh, for the iron farm and that zombie villager thing um, yeah then there's oak and birch and an occasional I'm going to add a uh, that warp and the what crimson crimson stem and warp stem houses which will be the really cool ones with the best villagers in living in them yeah that'll be cool uh, then there's this river which I told um after that we don't have anything much on the tour i'll uh, make you see my spawn in the nether which is the best spawn ever uh yeah that was sarcasm i'm very sad i haven't found a fortress yet i'm crying right now talking to you and crying sad stuff yeah, if you want to go anything uh, anywhere I have to pillar up from here go above and then out of the way because everything here is a dead end this is the scumpus technique 
used very often to navigate uh, yeah didn't hear oh, oh. Uh, yeah. this was just mining some code quads over here here there's a uh, lava dead end over here then here's the here there's nothing literally nothing here also there's lava uh, this I have dug up. I was trying to make my path there. There's a soul sand valley uh, ahead. I had to mine a lot of things ahead. I don't want to go there right now because there are a lot of casts and stuff. But I found two ancient debris on the way. Uh, there in my storage near the village. I'll show you. Let me just get back. Before we get there, these are my four doggies. Uh, I can breed them and make more. Uh, inside there are my cats as you can hear them really cute I have many more cats over there at the village I have tamed them all I wasted all my um, what do you call them cords and salmons on them and they do literally nothing they just sit all the time and whenever I take them with me they just make a lot of noise so I make them sit all the time yeah, so this is a really nice pattern of a house which I had created on my own. There are moss blocks over here. These are two useless villagers. Um, here's the most important part. A lot of uh, amethyst things. And uh, you might know from the video I had made for the trident video. Yeah, I, uh, that is the same trident which is here. I never enchanted it. I never used it. Um, uh, where's the ancient debris? Was it in here? Or oh, in that chest? I... Yeah, here's the ancient debris. I was mining on... Uh, uh, you... Was it Y30? 40 or something? Uh, don't know. Uh, but that was a really high level and I got ancient debris at that level which is really good it's turning night time again I'll have to sleep but anyways here is the farm stuff uh, carrots and potatoes to uh, sell the, to the villagers here's the occasional watermelons I have pumpkin seeds on me in the chests and stuff uh, here are the materials which I use for the building the, which I have kept for building the village uh, which are really useful I have uh, uh, I mean until I make my uh, make all the houses of the villages I have kept the beds of the villagers over here so uh, that might be the reason of the villagers dying but yeah I can always get uh, some others there are always possibilities uh, the, yeah always there are always possibilities let's linger write that in a book remember that I bet I might be in a book somewhere Here's the sugar cane, sugar cane farm, which I traded it all for, no, not all, well, mostly for uh, emeralds with the librarians. Here's the cool little dripstone running pathway thingy. Uh, I have bone meal a lot of it. This is really satisfying as you can see. Yeah, and I have bone meal a lot of it. Yeah, where was I? I had to the storage uh, went off uh, in my phone so I had to delete a lot of stuff uh, but now it's back I am back uh, this video is getting a little bit long but uh, yeah I have a lot of stuff and uh, knowing that I have to delete this world when, once 1.18 comes up the caves and cliffs part 2 because in Mine, uh, Minecraft Bed Bedrock and Pocket Edition you can't restore worlds and just uh, update them you need to update the game uh, and then sadly all your worlds are lost so yeah knowing all this progress will have to be gone still I like playing Minecraft it's good like a hobby or something so yeah that's good I guess and um, yeah there's nothing much left for you to see there are a lot of villagers over villages 
to adjacent villages somewhere over there and then uh, there's an acacia biome over there after the desert you can maybe see do i have a spyglass on me nope uh, but yeah i uh, you might be able to see yeah you see that acacia tree uh, there in the distance uh, uh after that acacia biome there are in that acacia biome there is one village and at the ed edge of it there's another plains slash acacia village which is cool i guess half acacia half plains this is half a okay, uh, desert half plains i am getting all half villages hello how are you huh? hmm? Hmm? i don't want to hit him because well then my trade rates will be higher so yeah uh, and i haven't found a fortress yet i'll maybe use a seed what's it called uh I have a nice app for that. It's called Chunk Base uh, to see the places where your are in your where the fortresses or dungeons or something are. I have I haven't used them for um, this uh, this episode. I mean this world. I had used them for earlier, but I thought they were like cheating. So yeah, I haven't used them. But yeah, I might use them to find a fortress. Because I need a weakness potions to um, weakness potions to cure villagers and get lower trades and stuff, which is really cool. Um, yeah, I guess that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you liked and if you want another one of these for the month of August, please like the video. That will be really helpful. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And there's another thing, wait, 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 yes, I finally got a cave, a really cool cave of the sun setting in the distance, I think this was for winning in a championship or something, that was a parkour challenge for bedrock edition, the pocket edition, and I had, I, come th I came third place in it, so I was gifted this cape, this was this really cool cape, uh, yeah, it feels like I have a lightra, I don't have right now i have defeated the dragon i have its egg somewhere i don't know but it's there somewhere but without any further delay i guess that's gonna be it for this video and i uh, hope you will hope you liked it and you will want another one for the month of august thank you for watching